It's refreshment time, folks. Hello, and welcome to the Frog Brothers YouTube page. Today, we're going to open up some of the Stay Puff Marshmallow Mini Puff Surprises. We're going to go through some of these numbers, this number stuff in a minute here, but each case comes with 12, and I believe two of each kind of mini puff. So I'm going to keep six of them sealed, open six of them. Now there is a number imprinted around the top here, but at the end of each one of those numbers, there's a NO and then six for this one, for example, uh, one through six. So that'll tell you which mini puff it is. So I'm going to get the plastic off all these first. All right. We've got all the plastic wrapping out of the way. We're going to dig into these now. Um, this is the number one. Um, again, I'm going to tell you there's a number imprinted right here, which I picked up a case for my brother and one for myself. Now his was numbered 00731. Mine is marked 00931. Does he have the other six? The one with the s'mores mini? I'll open this first one. Oh God. I already, uh, this already sucks. <laughs> oh. ah. All right, it's like a glue putty slime. Are they all wrapped in this? gooey awful mess. <laughs> this is terrible. I feel bad for some people who are going to be fucking getting this everywhere, including myself. I'm already getting it on my clothes. This is a disaster. So yeah, if you're wondering, Here's your marshmallow puff. <laughs> Look at this shit. Ah. It reminds me of the uh, fungus in the Mario Brothers movie. Although if you roll it together, it's really not too bad. I think you just gotta know what, what to do here. Somebody blows their load and you want to keep it, it's in another bag. And number one is going to be this guy. I like that it's always stuck to the roof of this thing. Because no matter what, you're... Getting into some shit. Oh god, yeah, this one's really fucking in. Look at that. Look at all that goo. Uh, Number two is Mr. Chocolate Bar. That's pretty damn cute. Come on. Seen this? Look at that. Pestilence. They should have just separated the marshmallow in there and just had the marshmallow there. But I don't know. Maybe it's kind of fun. Maybe I'm having fun and I don't know it. Or maybe it's pissing me off. I really can't tell. And number three is. Ooh. Mr. Matchstick Drummer. I like the little Ghostbusters logo on top. Uh, which one? I have a couple of these. That's slipped off. There you go. There's another design under there. Okay, I took it all out with that. Look at that. Cup is empty. All of it is right here. You know what that means. I'm really gonna have to play with this. <laughs> oh god. I feel like I'm 10 and I'm trying desperately not to fuck up the shag carpeting in my grandma's trailer. 
And we have the rocket mounted mini pup. If Johnny Knoxville was a fucking mini pup, this would be it. Go see Jackass Forever in theaters. Now we're not sponsored by them. That'd be pretty cool though. Uh, sponsor us. We'll, we'll talk about your movie. It might be a really sad movie. Is that a thumbnail shot? For number five, we've got, ooh, this one's pretty slick looking. The Flamin' Model. Ah, Jesus Christ, I'm on fire! Which uh, would have to be Mr. Pencilly Boy. Although this pencil's pretty bent, but it, it's kind of bendy, so. So, these are pretty cool. They're $5.69 each, which, I mean, it's a little pricey for a unique fixer upper, but I enjoy them. I'm glad I purchased a full box, and, uh, Thanks for joining us on the Frog Brothers podcast page. We have a lot of new Ghostbusters Afterlife merch this uh, this just week, this month, upcoming stuff we haven't talked about yet, stuff that hasn't been announced yet, I'm sure. Um, so stick around, hit that like, and subscribe.